Hello guys. <coughs> oh shit. <coughs> Hello guys, Imano from Exception here, and today I'm going to be giving you guys three alternative browsers to Google Chrome. Now, almost all of you must have heard of Google Chrome. It's like the popular browser, most popular browser in the world. Anyways, I'm going to be giving you three alternatives to Google Chrome. Let's begin. And welcome back guys. Now the first browser I'll be talking about today is called Vivaldi. It was actually started by um, someone who used to work at Oprah, John Stephenson. I, I don't know which position it is. But anyways, Vivaldi is a brand new take on Chromium, which is the engine that actually powers Google Chrome. So in a kind of way you're actually using Google Chrome, but except it's Chrome without the Google. Anyways, um, it provides a very sleek, minimalistic user interface with very clean interface settings. And I particularly like the new tab page. It's very, very sleek. Uh, it has also has like this color theming options where if you visit a web page it will actually theme the whole browser to um, match the color of that web page so the first browser I will be uh, recommending to you guys to download now which will be in the uh, description below is Vivaldi browser and the second browser I'll be talking about is called project Maelstrom it was actually developed by the guys over at BitTorrent It's a very torrent centric browser in the fact that um, you can directly interact with torrents directly in the browser like let's say you want to uh, you can get a magnet link and you can directly view uh, stream uh, videos files from the browser itself so i think that is the main selling point and uh, i've basically just been using it for uh, torrents related stuff but it's a worthy mention so the second uh, browser I'm recommending to you guys is Project Maelstrom by BitTorrent. And the third browser I'll be talking about is called UC Web Browser. Now people who used phones during uh, Java days and Symbian days must remember this browser very well because it was very popular at least where I came from. But UC Web Browser is basically a take on the same Chromium engine which I talked about earlier. So basically the folks at UC Web took that, uh, the Chromium engine, and they built their own browser on top of it. And um, it looks really sleek, it's really fast, it's one of the reasons why I tried it in the first instance. But theming options, not so much. The themes are very limited, very gimmicky. But apart from that, it's an alternative to Google Chrome that you can actually try. So, and that is the third browser, UC Web. As usual, the links are in the description below. Okay, guys, this has been the three um, top alternative browsers to Google Chrome. And if there's something you actually notice is the fact that all three alternative browsers are actually based on Google Chrome. And that is actually very scary because this uh, means that uh, there are very few limited options when it comes to alternatives. Or I, I, I don't know about you guys, but if you guys use a different browser apart from the three browsers I actually mentioned now, why don't you leave it in the comment section below. Let me check it out, download it, and give it a try. But anyways, that has been it for this video, guys. Don't forget to give it a like if you like it. Uh, give it a dislike if there's something you dislike in this video. You can just, you know, type it up in the comment section below. Anyway, that has been it. Um, I will catch you guys the next time. Don't forget to be awesome. Check out other videos on this video, and I will catch you guys next time. Bye.